Hello again guys, how is it going? My name is Faker and welcome to another Legends of Rune Terror video. Got the Bandle Tree today. Now Bandle Tree has been through uh, so many nerfs throughout time that it's become pretty much meme territory now. But with the most recent expansion, we did get access to Poro Stories, which does allow you to generate three random Poros. And now all the Poros do come from different regions. So that's quite a decent boost to the deck. Now, even though this could be considered a meme deck. Look, I think you can effectively do Bandle Tree now pretty quickly, especially if you're playing Jax for the multi-region weapon masters, which go to pretty much do the Bandle Tree very quickly. The issue is not so much how fast you do it, it's whether or not your opponent's playing landmark removal or can kill you fast enough, which has always been Bandle Tree's kind of like weakness, right? It's always been that. But now like the Bandle Tree needs you to see them. So Bandle Tree needs to be on the field and see all the followers, but you know, it's still pretty easy to navigate victories. If your opponent has got landmark removal, they might actually be in trouble. Uh, but yeah, got a couple of pretty sick games here today where we're able to do the Bandle Tree pretty effectively. And the opponents have to sit there and be like, wow, I just lost the Bandle Tree in patch 3.21. Enjoy the games. Leave a like if you um, had fun here today. And uh, subscribe if you are new here for more Legends of Rune Terror videos. Have a good one. Ooh, Champion Strength. That's probably going to be a bit hard for us. Yo, so we're basically... Just going to get the Bandle Tree. We're going to full mole for the Bandle Tree. Nothing but the Bandle Tree. Group Shot's going to be useful, I guess. But we can we can definitely race them. Theoretically. I have Signpost to delay. I want to shoot this now before there's any combat tricks, maybe? Nah, fuck it. Uh, I don't know. I'd rather not shoot it. Look, book and a cat in the lap. Look, versus Conchologist. Go for Con. Bouncing Bomb's going to be but useful, so we'll take that. And I'm actually going to take this attack. That's a little bit annoying. We'll use the bouncing bomb here. Rangers resolve, uh, GG. Hits the group shot. That should be the card they increase, right? Skip and a hop. Two and fro, fro and two. Okay, we have to play the Bandle Tree. Porosaurus is going to be nice for getting like a thousand blockers. Nice. These are all good hits because they're like not really in, uh, interfering with our regions. We have to go doubling up here, I think. Attack's fine. We'll go for the elusive Poro and probably Destin Poro. Mm -hmm. Elusive. Our stream is a region we can access quite easily. I guess we have to consider that. Maybe Freyold's a better line here. We also get a Targon. We're hitting Lonely Poro from the Poro story. This is actually kind of absurd. So hopefully we just don't hit like, we hit the Mars here. That's like pretty good for us actually. So they're going to champion strength, right? Oh, I guess not. Well, in that case, 
We're gonna go Targon. We're gonna go stream of Bilgewater. Because this is not that much damage. Persistence is key. I don't even care if I'm removing things that much. Not really sure what the trinket trait is supposed to achieve. What are we? Six out of ten? Seven, eight, nine. We can literally win next turn. Challenger, butcher, maybe. Seven. Eight. Nine. And hopefully the next card we draw is cheap enough that we can still play signpost. Fantastic. Ten. Then he hits me with a Bandle Tellstones from Conchologist and kills my landmark. Rip. Pog. Literally magnificent high roll of every cheap unit in Poro Story is just really giving us the goods. Okay, we're just going to full mole, obviously, for the Bandle Tree. There we go. And Poro Stories too. Now, next step. Hopefully they're not playing uh, Desert Naturalist. Because I don't think we can beat that very much. But they are very slow. We could find a second Bandle Tree and maybe there's still a chance. I want to pass here in case of um... Rock hopper. Would you look at this place? Blaze of the Fallen's good. Can give us Sharima. Pass here. Sharima, your emperor has returned. What are my options? Cast away. You can fix anything with anything. I'll prove it. Hopefully it disincentivizes the Azir swing. Why would they swing with Azir anyway? It's a good question. I'll play to the fallen here for sure. It is time. Don't see any reason Only not to block this. Cool. So this means Bell Tree is going to come down. Obviously, we're going to have three completed already. Oh dear. Then here's where hopefully things just start to high roll for us, right? So ideally, we don't hit like a Demacio or Freehold from the first proc. Once the turn ends, we'll obviously give us a ally in hand that we don't already have. The Oasis of the Dawn flows again. Could swing here, but doesn't benefit us to swing. Freeing them up board space is not actually good for us. They can sometimes brick. Uh, we didn't hit uh, Freyold. Oh, sorry, Freyold or Demacia. That's good. In this scenario, I'm asking myself. What are my best lines here? I can always only ever play two. I think I just want to do two regions at once. With combat cook. My place, Captain. Hey, they patch up the hall real good. Ease your worries. We don't actually Yours block this. Given. We can block this, so Wait that's fine. Alright, hopefully it's not Ionia, Noxus, or Targon. Okay. Can we do the Bandle Tree this round? I don't think so. Oh, we'll go for this. Hey, fisher lady. Doesn't matter what we take. Nah, singing scares the fish. At least mine does. Targon SI.
Maybe it might be the Poro Stories angle here. Maybe we can get more completed if we high roll. Probably should have opened this turn with it first. I don't think... Like, I think we always play Hookmaster though, so it doesn't really matter too much. Free old Bandle. So that's Bandle, SI, Cheaper, Targon. So we can go three this turn, actually. What a shame for you. One. Ah. Uh. So there was a Desert Naturalist, unfortunately. So now... Probably just have to draw for another one. Everybody has landmark removal. It's a bit annoying. Arise. Do we have time to make it there? Like we can chump block for like forever. Which is true. Yeah, why not? It is time. Your emperor commands. This can block. Draw two, hopefully Bandle Tree. If not, that's pretty sad. Hand is not full, so we can pass. But we probably want to put units onto the field. Makes sense to probably go for Targon here. I'll become who I was always meant to be. Unlimited power, mind to control. Alright, so we really want Bandle Tree this turn, right? Don't think there's any other option. Do I have any more card draw cards? I do not. Maybe a mayor can find me something. Oh, that's a banal tree. Maybe we can slam it, get all these regions completed. I mean, a lot of them are overlapping. Maybe it is open attacks, full send. The order is given. So we can throw away Bandle. That's fine. We've got Shreema Noxus in hand. That's it fine. A ghost. Bilgewater. We have Bilgewater in hand. That's fine. Get shipwrecked. Maybe there's better ways to do this. No, this is the only way to really strike if you must do it. Don't think there's any like damage from over the top I'm concerned about currently. This is the only play that really makes sense to me. First action, obviously Bandle, so we can see the regions. I'm thinking, I'm thinking Mare? Hasn't seen Targon. We have SI in hand. We need Targon. So we take Telescope. We are Drawing cards.
Doesn't matter what we take here. Okay. Build water. Targon. Like we have everything here, I think. PNZ, build water, and Targon. Alright. There's a chance if they haven't got another Desert Naturalist. I guess it's the messenger. And is that it? Do they have the naturalist? Or a way to kill me by some miracle? Um, we can signpost that. Fantastic news. That was almost a bit scary, but signpost clutch! Signpost clutch! Send that back into his hand. Now what's your plan? Is that it? Did we get it? Nice. And that's the Bandle Tree. Oh. Hulk Champ. 